Holding on to muscle on your body is a luxury. Your body is not used to doing that. Your body's not designed to do that. Your body uses, decides based on what you're using and what you're doing. And if you need the muscle because you're doing something active, and let's say thousands of years ago you needed to climb trees, etc., your body would keep that muscle. But at some point, if not enough food was coming in or not enough protein for that matter to have the building blocks for those muscles, your body would not keep it. It, it would say that this is superfluous. It's a luxury. We do not need to keep this muscle, get rid of it. Use it as energy because we're probably, we're starving right now. There's nothing else coming in. We, we need to use it. And for that matter, keeping fat on your body is technically a luxury too because there was not many times in our evolution where there was so much food available that we were able to store so much. So for that matter, a lot of what we're doing is because of the luxury we have of so much food available and not having to expend so much energy. And it would seem like the first step in this equation is how much food that we're taking in. And it's probably why they say that nutrition is, is more important than exercise. And I, I, I regretfully admit that exercise alone is probably not enough for most people. But holding on to muscle and holding on to fat is a luxury. So first and foremost, we need to be grateful. As much as we might even want to get rid of the body fat that we have, we need to be grateful to realize that we're in a position in a time that we have so much extra energy on our body and we get to keep it on our body because there's no point in time that no food is coming in and we're starving and our body uses that excess energy as, as fuel. Think about that. Be grateful for the luxury of being able to hold on to the muscle and the fat. And for that matter, that's why it's so hard to put muscle on for some people is because you have to continually bring in more protein, keep using the, the muscles as a stimulus, but your body is not really designed to keep a lot of muscle on your body all the time. It, because muscle uses a lot of energy, it's, it's a very costly uh, tissue and it's not the same as fat. Fat does not cost that much, it's very minimal energy to maintain fat and, and much more so to maintain muscle. So maintaining muscle and fat is of course a luxury. So you want to, A, again, be grateful about that, but realize that if you want to maintain muscle, you have to continually stimulate your body to keep muscle. And for that reason, it's hard to get too big if, if you're not intending to do it. You have to purposely continue to put protein in, continue to do exercise, continue to eat more than you were eating before to grow. It's a luxury your body does not normally have the opportunity to experience. So be grateful, of course, but also realize that you, you don't accidentally get there and you can make changes because your body does not want to keep a lot of muscle on and your body does not want to, it wants to keep fat, but you do, at this point in time don't need to keep on fat because there's food coming all the time. So if you do this right, you can realize that it's not a lot easier than it may have been in the past to maintain muscle and maybe a little bit harder to, to get rid of fat but in the end it's not impossible it's simple and it's straightforward it's just not easy but if you look at it in this lens maybe it gives you the perspective you need to hear